All I'm saying is that we're young, we're fresh, we're healthy. All right, we're going nowhere, neither are you. Oh, I really like the second one. Look at all that light. Gorgeous. Mm, but the first one has bigger rooms. I don't really care about the light. Girl, who would want to live in a dark and danky place though? Trust me on this one. Mm, I don't know. Maybe we need to keep looking? Fine by me. But hey, I must admit, your enthusiasm's lit fire under my bum. I need to stop looking at this place as home and really start to look into the next phase of my life. Yeah, I mean, I'm always thinking about my next move. I don't know, maybe it's the performer in me, but I'm just always about new experiences. I still and will always think bots is the best place on earth, but it's just time for newness. Sure, but I don't want you to think Josie's paradise. It's tough here, and COVID's made it even tougher. I still want it. And I think there may just be light at the end of this here tunnel. Really? How bright? <laughs> bright like a diamond. So there's this guy I met a few months ago at a charity gig my mom organized. Stinking rich. He's some mining magnet. He's all up in my DMs and he's pretty persistent too. Why do I sense a bud coming up? Well, he's quite old. How old? <laughs> my mom's age? Well, God, no. But if I squint really, really badly, he looks like he could be Denzel Washington's distant cousin. <laughs> Girl, now you're reaching. I know, but I reckon if I date him for just a few weeks, you and I will have enough money to move into that flat. I'd be a fool to pass that up. No, oh, you'd be a fool if you even consider it. Why? Because... It's just my gut feeling. It says it's a bad idea. Well, your gut needs a chill pill. Sounds foolproof to me. Listen, Bokang, I have a friend who got caught up with an older man. She thought she had everything under control. Next thing is forcing her to have sex without a condom. He paid for everything and for her family back at home. So trust me, you don't want to go that route, Bokang. Well, I'm not like your friend and I actually have my shit together. Just imagine us waking up in our own flat. It'll be so much fun. There's this other friend who got involved with a guy she thought was a sweetheart. He also paid for everything and treated her extra special until he started controlling her every move. He beat her up, Bokang. And she made excuses for him. It took her everything to get out of that relationship. So do not take money from men, Bokang. It never ends well. Never. Tineo. What the hell? Um. Oh, Mom, I know she was in that data she could still call me right now. Your sister still really pick my calls. Maybe she don't follow you talk anything. Nothing. You know, I even tried to speak with her the other day. She just shut me down so fast. <sighs> Sorry, Baba. But, but what are we going to do now? The, the guys be weird to convince her. Uh, I hate to say this, but... Far really changes her mind. You know, maybe it's time you just give up. You did joke, Abby. <sighs> okay, this is the thing. Family is everything to Far. And she would not want to be the reason you don't have a relationship with your mother. 
no matter how much she cares about you. But what about what I want? I be a no guessy for this kind of matter. She's more stubborn than a donkey. <laughs> That's far for you. But I need her. See, me and Fa, we don't did it for each other. I I, I know if he's talking the same thing about my mom, see. You know what? Uh, maybe there's one more thing we can try. A hundred masks deep. Like who knew how things so would bring such rewards? Bali is my new favorite person. I'm gonna be able to save my salon. I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah, this is amazing, guys. I'm so happy for you. I can't stop smiling. Like my face is even starting to hurt, but I don't care. A hundred masks, D. God is so good. Yeah, you needed some good news, man. Lockdown has been rough. Yeah. What's wrong? I just realized that I don't know how the hell I'm going to do a hundred masks that quickly. Ah, oh, man, that's easy. With my help, of course, I'll come over in my mask and we'll social distance nicely in the backyard and make your mask while listening to the Yanos. <laughs> Dee, are you gonna come help me? Really? Yeah, but don't look too happy because you're gonna pay me for my services. No problem. Fine, done. I think I should actually pay Limo something as well because he really, really helped me with my website. Mm, that kid has done the most. I mean, you have a whole brand because of him. I know. Like, I couldn't have done it without him. Now that schools are closed, I think I should officially hire him as like my tech guy slash brand manager. That way, he can make money and stay out of trouble because kids with too much time on their hands get themselves into trouble. Yeah, that's a great idea. And I'm sure he'll love that. Yeah. <laughs> Skimmer, are you sure you want to do this? We can always chat later. No, 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 no. I'm cool. I'm cool. We can talk. <sighs> okay, so, um... I managed to find a, <clears throat> a private lab and got some tests done. I was so weak, I couldn't even walk up the stairs, Skim. Every time I coughed, the driver would give me skiff looks the whole drive. <clears throat> that sounds really rough. It is. Like every time I coughed, he had sprayed sanitizer in the air. Once he dropped me off, I swear he sped off so fast I saw sparks under his car. Skim, you don't look too good, eh? Suddenly all of this has become so real. You know, when I was at the lab and I got tested, I, I realized that I could have corona. Shit is real out there, Mali. Okay. We have to concentrate on, on positive things. <sighs> oh. I can't even taste or smell anything anymore. It's just... It's just weird. Campbell. I'm for real. I mean, the one minute I could smell something, and the next I couldn't. I don't know what... My lungs feel like glass. God, I know, Chomi, I know. But we need to stay positive. <coughs> oh. And I really hope I didn't infect you. I would never be able to live with myself if anything happened to you. I'll be fine, Skim. I'm not going anywhere. This is awesome! This massive order is going to save my business. You've got no idea. And so, as you know, I'll soon be doing my mask giveaway to you, my loving, loyal followers. But I thought I should first introduce to you the talent behind the masks. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, meet the Divalicious designer, Zamo. Welcome, Zamo. What's good, sis? You know what? It has been tough. 
but you get to do what you can. And that is why I started my business, Pajazzled Babe. That is at Pajazzled Babe on all social media. All right. Yeah. Um, it's small efforts, but it's putting one foot in front of the other. Corona has taught me not to be hard on myself and to appreciate the little things. Mm. All our lives have been turned upside down. But the only way we can beat this is if we band together and help each other out. I couldn't agree more, Zamo. And this is a perfect example. I mean, I'm here chilling with you and your hundreds and thousands of followers. So it could really, really help me push my business at Pajazzo, babe, and get more followers. So I'm very excited and I'm very grateful for this. Oh, well, if it wasn't for me, it definitely would have been somebody else. Your masks are awesome. People need to know about them. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much Mbali. So you all heard it from her, the one and only Mbali. It is <laughs> at Bejazzled Babe on all social media platforms. At Bejazzled Babe. One word. Don't you forget it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Bejazzled Babe. I think they got it. So you're one of those enterprising types making employment for yourself during the age of COVID-19. Well done to you. And did I mention how gorgeous and stylish they are? So glam. I mean, you could wear them with a ball gown and they wouldn't be out of place. There's truly a mask for every occasion. I try. I really try. And big ups to you, Mbali, for supporting my business at Bejazzled Babe. A lot of people can't afford to buy their own masks. So this could actually be saving lives. Well, you heard it here first. Then that brings us to the end of our riveting interview. Thank you so much for tuning in, my lovelies. Now, the first hundred peeps to DM me get a free mask. Now, don't say I didn't tell you. Until next time, say bye, Zamo. Bye, everybody. And don't forget, it is at Bejazzled, babe, on all social media. Yeah, yeah. I'm still recovering from your friends and their horror Malome Bay stories. I know. Scary stuff, man. That said, I just got a call from Josebo. Who's Josebo again? The mining magnet I told you about. Why would you do that? After everything I said, Bokang. <sighs> Look, I, I had every intention of of ignoring him, but he found out where I lived and he dropped off the most exquisite pair of shoes I've ever seen. I don't care. You would if you saw them. It's those distinctive ones with the colored bottoms. I cooked breakfast in them this morning and yo, I felt like, you know, one of these fancy housewives of what what. Oh, come on. I mean, I would have been rude to not at least say thank you. I wasn't raised by wolves, Dineo. What you should have done is taken them back, Bokang. This is how they trap you. Well, I don't feel trapped. In fact, I feel liberated. If I'm smart about this, I could actually make it work for me. I just need to make sure that I'm always the one in control. And once I've gotten enough money out of him, I'll just dump his old wrinkly ass and move to SA with you. You sound so dumb right now. <laughs> no. Your friends just didn't know how to play the game. That's why they got burnt. Those friends I was telling you about. Well, it was me, Bokan. Those horrible things happened to me. And you know where I'm staying now? At a woman's shelter because I got out of that abusive relationship a few weeks ago. Oh my word, Dineo, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for being a bitch about this. I also thought I knew how to play the game, Bokang. I thought I had it all figured out, but that's not how it works. He has all the power, meaning he has all the control. You'll always come out a loser until you don't know who you are anymore. Okay, I hear you. 
I'm done with that old man. Done. I promise. What's up, massive people? <coughs> it's your boy, massive man, because no one else can. So I've got a bit of bad news for everyone today, and that is uh, that I've tested po positive for COVID-19. Um, I know it's a bit of a shocker for everyone. It's a shocker for me too. You know, I'm still trying to wrap my head around it, but uh, fear not because Joe Massive will be back and stronger than ever, you know, stronger than some funny flu. So, um, you know, I'll be causing a ruckus in no time, you know, just, just the way you guys like it. <laughs> <coughs> oh. Sorry about that, guys. Um, but in all honesty, I'm, I'm feeling a lot better already. So I'm hopeful that in no time, I'll be able to beat this thing. You know, I'll be back to my old self, hey? So, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. You guys take care of yourselves and remember, you remember, stay, stay massive. <laughs> have any questions about COVID-19, text the word COVID to plus four one seven nine eight nine three one eight nine two on WhatsApp. For more information about coronavirus or related issues, visit mtvsugar.com forward slash alone together. Terms and conditions apply.